we're all looking at the same data, but we're not comprehending it the same way. We're comprehending it differently, even though the same data is exactly in front of us. Why is that? That is, this is so important. This is so important important to me. It's what I'm actually very passionate about. We're in this place in society where we all see the same thing, but we're comprehending it differently. We're thinking about it differently. We're disagreeing, even though the same information is directly in front of us. And I think this is where epistemology really matters. So why does epistemology matter? I got into a recent discussion about this, about epistemology as it relates to um, these studies and how we're not comprehending each other on social media and, and not everyone necessarily agrees, but I think, I think it does matter. And, and, and this is why people aren't dumb, even if they aren't scientists or experts in philosophical approaches to epistemology and critical thinking, they instinctively know when an, a, a falsifiable claim is being twisted to be infallible. People have seen experts make mistakes and be wrong. People have heard the science is clear when it wasn't. People see it in all aspects of modern society and they have the right to be skeptical. People in society are right to carry skepticism of experts based upon our history. I don't think statements like the science is clear is really helpful. The science isn't clear to the general public and instinctively, however, discrepancies in epistemology can be more clear. Scientific and medical data, as we discussed, can be nuanced, detailed, and confusing. Um, but when it comes to epistemology, even if we're not experts in epistemology, people get it when falsifiable claims are put forward as unfalsifiable with things like the science is clear. 